Chris, just tell us about that first night testing the new train and how historic it was. Well, it's obviously a big moment for personally for me and for John, because we've been involved with the project for the last three years, but for the region as a whole and for Metro, um, it's a once in a lifetime opportunity for, for many of us that have been involved. And to be able to go out on its first night on the system was quite a privilege actually. And John, just tell us a bit about what the testing involved. So obviously the testing is just so the fleets fit for service. Uh, they do a lot of type testing. The first of all, they, they did a red signal, went through the red signal for the track brakes going down. Also, they did a lot of testing the brakes at high speed, at low speed, testing the doors, testing the step. Everything went exceptionally well. The train was out for a good four hours without any, any major problems. It was, it's, it was an excellent historic day for the Tenningware Metro and the Northeast. And Chris, just from your point of view, how the testing went? I don't think it could have went any better, to be honest. Um, we know what the train's capable of and we know what a great asset it's going to be. Um, we've watched it grow from a piece of paper, from a sketch on a piece of paper into, into the finished product, almost the finished product that we see now. Um, and we knew it was going to be good um, and we knew we'd taken a, a, a light year leap forward. But to actually be on it and experience it firsthand on our system, it outperformed anything we could have imagined. It, it, the drive was smooth. Um, the, the braking system was, was operating perfectly well, dynamic braking and, and powering was spot on. Yeah, the torque on the train was unbelievable. Compared to now, it's just a hundred times better how smooth it is. We've got aircon, we've got excellent brand new seating. It's just it's just a move to the future. As you can imagine, we've been driving trains for 40 years and they're a 40 year old train. It's going from a Mark One Escort to a Lamborghini. That's what the train crew think. It's an absolute fantastic piece of kit to drive. Unbelievable, just so excited to actually get behind the wheel and drive it and take passengers on it.